In this video, I am going to take the time to look at Fibonacci retracement. Leonardo Fibonacci was an Italian mathematician who came up with a formula that turned a series of numbers into ratios. Now, what those numbers are and what those ratios are, it doesn't really matter. We don't need to know that in order to profit from using Fibonacci in our trading what we do need to know is how to use it in our trading now how Fibonacci works is when there's a major swing or push in the market so we have this downtrend here but overall we have this major push from here to here Fibonacci retracement provides us with potential levels in the market where price could reach on its way back up and then reverse. And this video will make more sense as it goes on. So Fibonacci retracement looks something like this. We have the start of our Fibonacci retracement, we have our end, and then we have these key levels that I mentioned that can be used as potential support or resistance levels where price is going to reverse. So if we look at this major push down, our downtrend started here, here's the top of our swing or push and here's the bottom the end of the swing so I'll get the Fibonacci retracement I'll start it by clicking at the top of the swing and I'll end it at the bottom of the swing and you'll see that these potential level levels are shown on my graph these levels are potential areas where price could reverse as it retraces back up from this push in the market. These first three levels are the key levels, more so than the fourth. This first level can be referred to the 38, the second 50, 62, and 76. These first three levels are the key levels. We'll have a look at this retracement and see how our Fibonacci retracement works. So when price retraces from this major push, you'll notice that when price reaches this third level, which is our third key level, one, two, and three, price reverses pretty much on target. We have pin bars and engulfing candles, bearish pin bars and bearish engulfing candles appear on this level. And then price is soon rejected and reverses. We could do the same for this swing or push in the market. If we get our Fibonacci retracement, here's the start of our swing, here's the end. You'll notice once again, price reaches one of our key levels, this time level number two, and reverses. Let's continue looking at these major swings in the market. Here's our start and end. Price reaches our first key level and is rejected. Fibonacci retracement works better in trending markets and ideally we would only use it in trending markets. We have this major swing on the upside here 
if we use our Fibonacci retracement again so here's our start here's our end price then goes into a range in market and you'll notice this first fib level this first key level so one two three acts as the support in our range let's continue looking at price data we have another swing here if we use our Fibonacci retracement here's the start of our swing here's the end here are our key levels you'll notice there's a number of rejections on this key level number three and price is starting to move on the upside most trading platforms especially well established trading platforms will offer Fibonacci retracement because it's so widely used it's a necessity for many traders and the reason why Fibonacci retracement works is because so many traders use the fib levels as potential support and resistance or end of retracements it's self-fulfilling because traders are placing orders to buy and sell at those levels price moves accordingly